Creating your Canvas account. In order to create your Canvas account, you will need to access the confirmation letter that was emailed to you a week before your course date. When you open the confirmation letter, please read it in its entirety. The confirmation letter is full of important information as well as it explains how the course is operated to run. As you scroll through the confirmation letter, you'll see multiple links. In order to create your Canvas account, you will want to click on the link that says Canvas link. Only use this link when setting up your Canvas account. When you click on the Canvas link, you will be redirected to a web page. The web page will look like this one. It will say the name of the course and ask if you would like to enroll. In order to enroll in the course, please click on the large blue button that says enroll. From there, you'll be directed to a page where it either wants you to sign in or create your account. Since this is the first time you're creating a Canvas account, you will need to enter your full name. As your full name, please enter your first and last name. For the email address, you can use the company email address or your personal email address. Any email address will work as long as you have full access to it and it is not shared with another user. Once you have done both of those items, please check both checkbox and click on the blue button that says enroll in the course. From there, you will need to open up the email account in which you provided. This is usually a Gmail account, an Outlook, Yahoo, or AOL. Once you have opened up that email account, you'll need to look for the Canvas email. This email sometimes takes up to 30 minutes, which is why we encourage users to register for their Canvas account multiple days in advance to the course. Once your email comes through, it'll look like this. It'll tell you that your registration is complete. In order to finish completing your registration, you will need to finalize. You can either click on the link that says, click here now to finish the registration process, or the large blue button that says, complete registration. From there, you'll be directed to the Canvas sign-in page. This will automatically auto-populate the email address in which you provided. Next, you will need to create a password. This password needs to be at least eight characters. It can include numeric numbers, special characteristics, or capitalization. The most important part is that you write this password down. The technology transfer program does not have access to your password. Therefore, if you lose it or cannot remember it, we will not be able to access it for you. You will need to go through Canvas and use the forgot password button in order for them to locate your password and help you access your account. Once you have got your email address and password loaded into the sign-in system, please click the large button at the bottom that says register. From there, you will be directed to another page. This web page will say the name of the course, as well as congratulations, you have successfully enrolled in the program. If you are ready to access your account now, click on the button that says go to dashboard. From there, it'll open up the Canvas course. You will see the terms and conditions which you will need to agree to in order to continue to your course. Please note that if this is a testing course, you will not be able to access anything further on this page as the exam has not opened yet. Congratulations, you have successfully set up your Canvas account. If at any time you feel like you've made a mistake or you need help accessing this, please contact the Technology Transfer Program as we'll be able to answer any questions or comments that you may have.